it's over. And Jake Paul destroyed him in one round. Poor seven figure give up because like that was over too quickly. Jake, like what a le level of boxing. Like probably the best YouTuber in terms of boxing. But yeah, if he lost that, he would have been gone, he would have been finished. But poor Gibber, like almost, he almost did it. So close, well. I mean, think about it this way. Like, they, they both put in the work, but Jake clearly wanted it more, needed it more. He needed that win and he got that W that his brother couldn't. And now it's on to JJ and he's gonna try and beat KSI as well. And the rivalry is there, it's more bitter than between Logan and KSI. And we're gonna see. And I, I can't wait, I'm like, KSI was so annoyed when, when, when Gibb lost. Rightly so, because now he's got a got to end bulking season and fight Jake Paul at some point it's going to be lit it's going to be a crazy fight and you just see Eddie Hearn grinning away because he knows this is another payday for him payday for everyone and JJ again really probably going to be the richest YouTuber or definitely up there for sure like the money they're making off this but the funniest thing over the whole event was when uh, JJ and Logan like were in the same interview uh, on Dan's, <laughs> just own Dan's, whatever you call it. They put them in the same uh, like scene. Not, like they sat next to each other. It's like, oh my god, how is this happening? It's weird, you know. Couldn't get my head right. Even uh, Shannon Briggs, everyone's like at peace now, but not Jake and JJ. That's gonna be more Jake Paul v KSI. Wherever it is, it might be in Dubai. Who knows? Or Saudi. I don't know. But it's going to be amazing and it should be, it better be the last one. We said after Logan and KSI, like, end it here. Enough. Stop the madness, but no. So yeah, if you saw the fight, all Gibb did really just sat down and stood up really fast and kept staggering over himself, literally. Like, he was staggering like he was drunk. And I, I, There's no other way of saying it. He looked like he was having a little dance, you know. Um, shame that I wanted him to win. Um, I, from the beginning I said though, Jake's probably a bit stronger. Physically more like... More, I don't know, just wedge. Compared to Gibb, who used to be overweight, you know, and... Credit to him the transformation that he's made to get to this level. And it's still a big payday, don't get me wrong. And great for his career, but... Like, obviously you've got to win it. He didn't, it's on to the next fight. And that, that is it, one win or one loser, that's it. That's what it comes down to. Who wants it more? And he had Jake had Sugar Shane Mosley as coach, and that says it all. Who JJ gets as coach, I don't know, because Vidal Riley's hanging up his boots, or his, I don't know, clipboard, I guess, if you're a coach, you wouldn't have boots, you'd have a clipboard. But yeah, he wants to focus on his own career, which is good. I mean, there's a lot of potential YouTube fights out there. Logan wants to fight Antonio Brown. That will end badly for Logan because AB is a beast. And yeah, he's not playing NFL anymore, but you bet he's still training. And he's still he's waiting for a team to pick him up. Um, so that is BS, really. Antonio Brown, Logan, come on. This is for show. It's like taking a mick. But that is YouTube, and that's what's going on. Um, I've got another podcast... Probably going to come a bit later than usual, like next week, or may, I don't know, I might shoot one today and then release that next week, because I'm off to Nottingham for the weekend, Padger football's back, score some goals, create some chances and just, just bury it, basically, in the back of the net. <laughs> but yeah, KSI, Jake Paul is the next big fight, speaking of boxing, but I'm going to end it there, it's just... My reaction really is crazy. I, di I didn't stay up and watch the fight. Would have been a waste of time. In one round, just done. Not even two minutes. Like, three knockdowns, that's it. And, you know, we saw who's the better boxer. And we're going to see 
between JJ and, Lo and Jake, who really is the top dog, you know. JJ is sitting on the throne already. He's got that belt, he's got that W. Jake's got AW and he's trying to look for the next W. So we're going to see like how crazy things get. This is the top, the top. And it should be the last fight. But thank you guys. I'm um, your host, Bluezy21. Another vlog, reaction video, whatever you call it, I don't know. But until next time, keep, I don't know, keep doing whatever you're doing. Like, stay humble. If you do get in a boxing ring, train hard and you probably will. Well, that, that might not be enough to win. You, you need the proper, like, killer instinct to win. So don't forget that. And I certainly ain't gonna forget that this weekend on that pitch. Gonna bury some goals. Do a couple of skills, you know. Like, leave defenders in my way. And that is it. Take it easy, guys. Have a good weekend.